Hey yo! Today I'll be showing you how to cosplay your favorite fish babe, Undyne. I'm starting off with a pre-painted bald cap already on and covering my ears. If you want to see how I put on that bald cap, you can watch the intro to my Underfell Papyrus tutorial here. I'm going to go ahead and glue on the fins I made out of layered paper painted with the same face paint as a bald cap. The vein parts of the fins are made out of hot glue painted on with red nail polish. I cut out a hole in the back of the bald cap enough so that my hair bun could stick out the back. This tactic may not work if your hair is short. For the hair, I took a cheap red rocker wig and hot glued a big hair clip on the inside of it. This will be clipped to my own hair sticking out of the bald cap. I decided to go with this method because it's a lot closer to Undyne's sprite art. Now for the tedious part of painting the rest of my face blue. The brand that I'm using is Ruby Red, which is similar to Snazaru because I'm cheap like that. It does pretty well for me though given how sensitive my skin is, but I don't know. Don't hold me accountable if you break out. I'm going to seal this with some colorless powder before moving on since I'm going to be wearing an eye patch. Baby powder works just fine for this if you want to be cheaper, although this stuff isn't really necessary. So Undyne's got some big fishy eyes, so I'm going to extend my own with the power of makeup. I realized that your vision really starts to suck when you're using only one eye, so I had to flip open my eye patch. Maybe I should have waited till the end to put it on. Undyne's also got some mean looking brows. If you look at the sprite, it has a unique shape since the brows are thicker in the middle rather than the part that's closest to the nose. So I'm going to go ahead and mimic that using black face paint. Fishy Wife also has those big lips to smooch your lizard girl with, so I'm extending my lip line to accommodate for that. My hands get shaky sometimes, and it sucks. So in order to keep my line sharp, I paint in short strokes and keep my wrists still, and move my entire arm and head to keep from making the wobbly line. I always draw the end with a little perpendicular line to give the illusion that the smile is actually part of and interacting with the skin. I also extend the back of the extended lips across my entire bottom lip to minimize that break between my real and drawn mouth. Here I'm trying to add some shading, but the shade of blue I got to act as shadows suck, so I gotta put on a lot of it to make the contouring noticeable. I'm just smudging it on with my fingers at this point because it's cheaper than a $4 makeup sponge, you know? Yeah! For the red, I'm using Ben Nye Grease Paint. This stuff smears a lot, so it's better to use this for accents than base colors. Fishies are moist, so they glisten and stuff, which means plenty of shiny lines, or you know, what others call highlights. So I'm taking my white face paint and marking areas like the lips, the edge of the mouth, the nose, and just about any part of the face and neck that bumps out. Cameras fade out a lot of your hard work, so it's good to over contrast. I'm taking some dark eyeshadow and going over the parts that really need some depth like the cheeks, the lips, the nose, and the neck bones. Nothing makes you more accomplished in makeup than being extra, I think. So I'm trying adding a bit more realism by spritzing white face paint around my cheeks and chin. I guess I was thinking more of like fish freckles or something at the time. It would have been better to use a toothbrush though. The teeth are made out of four parts, a pair of werewolf teeth and a pair of vampire teeth. I refashioned it to sit on my own two front teeth. All of these were gotten at Walmart or Walgreens at some point during Halloween. And whoop 
de doo you're done. Hey! Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope it helped for those who wanted to try cosplaying Undyne and stuff. If you enjoyed the tutorial, feel free to hit that like button or not, and subscribe Uru, to keep up to date with future videos and stuff. So, yep, yep. I'll see you later. Bye! You're bundled up now, wait till you get older But the media men beg to differ Judging by the whole